Hello, I'm Heather Slusser with the University of Wisconsin Division of Extension. Today I am joined by Dr. Maria Jose Fuenzalita and Dr. Sandra Stitchin to talk about the fact sheet that they co-authored entitled, Ivermectin products for animals are not intended for COVID-19 treatment. Thank you for joining me today, ladies. Hi, Heather. Hi, Heather. Thanks for having us on. Maria, I was wondering if you could tell us what is Ivermectin? It's a drug for humans and animals to treat internal and external parasites, including certain types of worms, fleas, ticks, and lice. The FDA has approved use of ivermectin tablets and topicals to treat internal parasite head lice and rosacea. In animals, ivermectin is FDA approved for prevention of heartworm disease in dogs and cats and for treatment of certain internal and external parasites in livestock. Can ivermectin be used to treat human COVID-19? Recently, the public through public media sites and social media became aware of an article that was published by the Antiviral Research Journal, where the authors found that ivermectin reduced the growth of COVID-19 in cell culture. That research was not done in animals nor in people. So based on that report, while ivermectin reduces antiviral activity, nothing was determined about its ability to reduce the severity of the disease or disease progression in people that were infected with COVID-19. Any use of ivermectin for the prevention or treatment of COVID-19 should be avoided as its benefits and safety for those purposes have not been established. Data from clinical trials are necessary to determine whether ivermectin, or any drug for that matter, is safe and effective in treating or preventing COVID-19. The FDA has created a program to expedite approval for COVID-19 treatments, and ivermectin is not part of that program. The FDA is closely monitoring for fraudulent COVID-19 products and has asked major retailers for their help in monitoring online marketplaces for fraudulent COVID-19 products. What is the process for drug approval? For a new drug compound to be approved by the FDA, clinical trials are conducted first, and they're done across four phases. They're known as phase one, phase two, three, and four. The overall objective of these trials is to prove that the new drug is safe and efficacious for what it's supposed to be treating. As you can imagine, these trials take time to conduct. You need to follow the Center for Disease Control guidelines for reducing your risk of becoming infected with COVID-19. Stay in touch with your doctor. If you become ill, do not attempt to self-medicate using any human or animal drug. Thank you for sharing this information with us today, Dr. Fuenzalita and Dr. Stitchin. I really appreciate you taking the time.